Recently, James Webb Space Telescope has captured such a spectacular picture of the planet Jupiter for the first time. Actually, this picture was taken by James Webb on 27th July 2022. So let's see what is a James Webb Space Telescope. The James Webb Telescope is a space telescope designed primarily to conduct infrared astronomy as the largest optical telescope in space. Its high infrared resolution and sensitivity allow it to view objects too early, distant or faint for the Hubble Space Telescope. It will study every phase in the history of universe that includes formation of solar system, big bang and other theories that support life on other planets. The James Webb Telescope was launched on 25 December 2021 on an Ariane 5 rocket from Kouro French Guiana which is in South America and arrived at the Sun Earth L2 Langrange point which is 1.5 million kilometers from the Earth. The first image of the James Webb Space Telescope was released public on 11 July 2022. It is capable of looking about the past such as the first galaxies formed in the early universe through its longer wavelengths. These wavelengths will help the telescope to peer inside dust clouds from where the planets and stars are formed. The telescope is to travel at a distance of 1.5 million kilometers from the Earth to capture such a magnificent picture of Jupiter. The James Webb Space Telescope is NASA's lead development in collaboration with European Space Agency and Canadian Space Agency. The telescope has been launched in Ariane 5 ECA rocket from French Guiana which belongs to European Space Agency. Webb Space Telescope primarily mirror consists of 18 hexagonal mirror segments made of gold-plated beryllium which combined create a 6.5 meter diameter mirror. Unlike Hubble, James Webb Space Telescope observes in a low frequency range from long wavelength visible light through mid-infrared. The telescope must be kept extremely cold below 50 Kelvin that is minus 223 degrees Celsius such that the infrared light emitted by the telescope itself does not interfere with the collected light. So there are main four goals for this telescope. Number one, to reach or to search for the first galaxies formed after Big Bang. Number two, to determine how galaxies evolve from their earlier formation. Number three, to observe the formation of stars from the first stages and number four to measure the physical and chemical properties of planetary systems that's all in today's session see you soon